Hello, my name is John Kelsey. I'm a 25-year veteran of the electrical and structured cabling industry. Have you been thinking about growing your company and making more money? Have you noticed that structured cabling jobs are more competitive and that getting more projects is tough? To win and manage more projects, you need the right tools. One of the most important tools is a state-of-the-art estimating program that allows you to estimate your projects quickly, accurately, and profitably. In a few brief minutes, you'll see how Red Rhino streamlines structured cabling estimates. Red Rhino is an online estimating program. You can log on from any computer using the internet. You can use Red Rhino to estimate both structured cabling and electrical projects. We're at the Red Rhino homepage, the central control panel from which you navigate to your estimates and manage your projects. The homepage takes you to any part of the program with just a few clicks. What you see here is a list of estimates, so let's take a look at one in some detail. This is a sample estimate. Now let me show you just how easy it is to estimate structured cabling projects using the built-in assemblies. This is the takeoff input page. As you select the materials on the left, they populate to the right. Let me show you what I mean. Next I'm going to navigate to the assemblies list. Assemblies are a tool for rapid input of materials. Notice that Red Rhino has several ready-made assemblies for structure cabling and electrical estimating. I click on structure cabling systems and Red Rhino displays the assembly categories. Now typically there's five different main installation categories in structure cabling. Horizontal station assemblies, closet assemblies, indoor backbone assemblies, outdoor backbone or OSP outside plant, and assemblies for miscellaneous. Horizontal station assemblies cover everything from the faceplate to the closet. They cover worker outlet stations where people sit and plug in computers and phones. The installation runs from that point all the way to the closet where the cables terminate. Closet assemblies include structures, racking, wall fields, termination hardware, and patch cords. Next you have indoor backbone or intra-level backbone. These are materials that go from one closet to another or from one floor to another floor inside of a building, including multi-strand fibers, multi-pair copper, some riser rated interducts, and certain coax cables. Next is outdoor backbone. This may be referred to as outside plant. And finally, is miscellaneous items includes items like fire stopping materials, dressing materials, pulling supplies, and labeling. Now I'm going to drill into horizontal stations. There it displays the assemblies down at the bottom left. At the top of the list are the four pair cable complements with one through six cable stations. Below that are the coax cable stations, one through four cable. At the bottom are the mixed cable complements, such as one four pair copper, one coax, and one fiber. Now it's time to demonstrate inputting the assemblies. I'm going to include one cable station, four pair assembly. I just type in a quantity of one and click add. Now type in the quantity of one, click the add button. Now at your fingertips, Red Rhino gives you all the components. You have the four pair cable, the cable face plates, jacks, the terminations, and cable labels. It's all right here. The closet side termination racks will be included in the closet assemblies. At the top line one is a description of the assembly, one cable station, four pair. Below that are the components included in the assembly. Each cable station assembly includes 150 feet of cable. Since I input a quantity of one four pair cable assembly, Rhino included 150 feet of cable. If you calculate that your average cable station length is different, you simply calculate how many feet the total length should be and retype it in the total quantity. Assemblies make your input very fast process. I basically typed in one number and input all the items you see there. Click save to save my work and go for the next assembly. In this example now, or with using Red Rhino, the unit prices or the material prices are set to zero. You get your materials quoted from your material vendors. Farther to the right, the program displays the labor to install all the cables. 
and the components. Now when using assemblies, you drill down in the assembly catalog, locate the assembly you want, type in the quantity, click add, and it populates them to the right. Next we're doing closet build out. There you see an example on the bottom left of the closet build out, different closet assemblies. I'm going to type in one of the two floor racks. Just click Add there. And notice I typed in one number and Rhino input a whole list of components included in the closet assembly. First it shows a description of the assembly. In this case it's two floor racks. And below are a list of materials included in the assembly. First is standard rack. Let me highlight it there. Now moving down is base anchor kit, base isolation kit. In this example I'm going to pretend or imagine that I need to add two base isolation kits. I just go over to quantity, type in the number two, go to the next item. Next is raised floor rack supports and double shelves. In this example, I'm going to say I need to add two shelves. Type in a quantity two, go to the next item. Next are your rack PDUs. Down below that, vertical wire manager, horizontal wire manager. Again, some of the items have zero quantity to the right. What they are is reminders. If you need them, you add them or add a quantity, whatever quantity you want. And if not, you just move on to the next item. Finally, at the bottom there is your rack labels. Go up to the top, click Save to save your work. Next, I'm going to click on Indoor Backbone Riser. Click on that. It displays the different assemblies. We have 25 pair through 1200 pair copper. Next is your coax, RG11, 0.5, and 0.75. and also six bundle DS3 coax. Now at the bottom there is your fiber, both multi-mode and single mode. I'm gonna scroll up to the top and enter a couple of assemblies here. What I'll enter is, I'll scroll up to the top and enter one 25 pair copper indoor. Click the add button. And when I click Add, Rhino adds the components like 25 pair cable, closet terminations, cross connections, 110 block kit, tie wraps, etc. You go through the list, make adjustments, and save your work. Again, some of the quantities show a zero. They're reminders. If you need those items, you type in a quantity, move on to the next item, click Save. Now outside plant and miscellaneous items work essentially the same. You locate the assembly, type in the quantity, make adjustments, and save your work. Now I'm going to show you a summary of the estimate called the recap. The recap displays a summary of the estimate and shows all the cost in the estimate. The top portion on this page displays percentages for overhead, profit, and tax and dollar rates for crew, general foreman, and superintendent. You can adjust any of these numbers according to your goals. On the right, it shows you the total material price, in this case $15,695. This is based on materials you input under quoted materials. The recap also displays total labor hours. In this example, the or this example estimate, Red Rhino displays there are 310.47 hours in the project. Finally, at the bottom, it shows the total price at $36,303. The total price in this estimate is carried over to the proposal, so you don't have to re-enter any information. The recap gives you speed and accuracy, and at a glance, you know your costs and your profit of any given project. Finally, I'll show you how to use this information and turn it into a professional-looking proposal. 
Red Rhino features an award-winning proposal format that provides your customer with a clear and concise proposal. All the numbers from your takeoff and recap flow directly to your proposal. What you see on the screen right now is a proposal as the document would look to your customer. The proposal is fast and easy to create. The proposal shows the price, list of inclusions, exclusions, and qualifications. Red Rhino proposals will reflect well on your company and set the customer's expectation of what quality of work you will deliver. You've seen how Red Rhino streamlines estimating so you can accurately bid and administer more projects to grow your business. The end result is more profit. To accelerate your use of this great program, as a customer we offer training videos available online 24-7. Also included is support from an industry expert. Just visit our website and click Order Now. My name is John Kelsey. If you have any questions, feel free to call me at 866-444-7411 or you can email me at johnk at hardhatis.com. That's J-O-H-N-K at hardhat, H-A-R-D-H-A-T, I-S.com. It's been a pleasure presenting our great product to you. Use Red Rhino and watch your profits grow.